Hello booktube and welcome back to Hours in My Library and today I am going to be highlighting a volume uh, it's just sort of at random uh, from a series of books that was done in the 40s. It, the series of books is called uh, Britain and Pictures and the one I've chosen is by Jaquita Hawks, uh, Early Britain. They are slim volumes that were produced during the Second World War by Collins. Uh, this one is a second printing, 1946, um, originally 1945. Now, it was their sort of idea to uh, do a series of books on sort of the culture of Britain uh, and including the Commonwealth. Uh, there's... They've become quite collectible in really good shape because they were produced with uh, wartime paper. And as you can see, it, it's hard to get. I, I collect only ones with dust jackets because the dust jackets become quite uh, flimsy. But as you can see, they're printed on uh, paper covered boards uh, with the same just, you know, sparse uh, cover. And they all have this sort of design different colors with a design on it and the title and the author's name george orwell is english-speaking people i think it is or the english people um is is done in here there was just many other uh popular writers and and some of those have become quite collectible as well it was produced by a company called they well they were produced by a company and put together by a company called ad print which is sort of kind of interesting because uh, I recently uh, knew a bookseller that bought the sort of archives from them. And, but I didn't know this until it was all over. And because I would have been particularly interested in getting the material and the pictures and layouts for uh, George Orwell's uh, volume. Uh, but nah, I wasn't able to. But these are wonderful. They have colored illustrations, uh, just beautifully done. Um, and they are sewing uh, the, the binding. And I call them sort of essays. They are in my essay section uh, because they're so short. They, they roughly run from about 50, 60 pages. Jaquita Hawks uh, was um, an archaeologist. Uh, she was born in 1910 and died in 1996. I had to look that up, but I knew a little bit about her. She was the first woman to go to Cambridge for archaeology or anthropology and archaeology. And along with Dorothy uh, Gerard, uh, she excavated at Mount Carmel uh, in Israel. Uh, Dorothy Gerard uh, wound up being holding the first chair um, at Cambridge uh, in archaeology, obviously. Uh, and uh, Chiquita Hawks was born Hopkins. Uh, her father was a noted chemist. I believe he won uh, uh, a Nobel uh, Prize for chemistry. But her father was also the cousin of Gerald Manley Hopkins, the the um, uh, uh, Victorian nineteenth uh, century uh, poet and. Uh, Jaquita Hawks uh, wrote a lot of books. Really, really good writer. Uh, she was really good at what she did. Uh, she edited uh, a lot of books, uh, wrote uh, widely uh, in the 50s and 60s. Uh, she wrote, I mean, she, she married somebody first in the 30s called Hawks, hence getting the name. But in the 50s, at some point, she married uh, J.B. Priestley, uh, who also did a volume, at least one volume, I believe, in this series as well. Uh, it's just, it's a series that I really like. I've got a whole shelf, like, you know, a wide shelf of these, and they add up, and um, I, I, I've meant to do sort of a tour of them at some point, and I might at uh, some time, but I thought I'd just pull one off. Well, this was the second one I pulled off. The first volume I pulled off was the Conservative Party, and I thought, nah, nah, no, 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 no. So then the second one I pulled off was this. <laughs> so I thought, yes, I'll go with this. An archaeologist? Yes, I'll go with archaeology. So anyway, uh, that is my um, hours in my library for today. Take care, BookTube.